Before we start today's video, friends, I want to give a quick thanks to my patrons over on Patreon. With their support, we're able to do many of the things you see on our channel with all the visuals we have, um, and including now, since I have my new computer, um, new editing software, and all that, they have supported me through the uh, entire process, so I want to give my sincerest thanks to them. I also want to, want to give a quick heads up in this video that the audio quality is a little iffy. I forgot to put my pop filter on my microphone, as you might have just heard there. I've been in a little bit of, uh, of a hurry making this, so as we've been packing up. So apologies for that. Um, I hope you can forgive me and know in the future uh, I will work on the quality. But yeah, hope you enjoy the video, friends, and I will see you around. Hey there friends, how is it going? Today we have something absolutely insane. I was super excited when I found out this is a thing. Um, apologies first off for the hiatus, we can talk about that later because right now um, this is something really special. Um, so I'm not misleading at all in the title, this is a way to get Primal Dialga. Um, not regular Dialga, Primal Dialga, into Explorers of Sky without any modifications to your game. It just uses Wonder Mail, which we'll get into in just a second. Uh, but first, I want to give a huge thanks to Shady Gamer and Shinx Hijinks over from the PMD Speedrunning Discord. You may have heard of, of, of them, you may have seen them around, so give them a huge thanks um, when you do see them, because this is awesome. And I'll leave some links uh, to any stuff they have um, in the description down, down below. Uh, but first off, this one is going to require some explanation. So what uh, Shinx Hijinx and Shady figured out is you can use the egg reward item. So let's go over to Chansey Daycare. Sometimes missions will have a reward where they give you an egg, um, and it goes on over here to Chansey, uh, where it can be hatched, and you get a Pokemon from that. It turns out the Pokemon you get from that egg is dependent on the dungeon you go to. So say if I go to a... Um, beach cave right here and i got a, an egg reward from beach cave that is what i would get i'd get a pokemon from beach cave and that egg so that is what this first mission is right here um, i'll post these wonder mail codes for you in the description so you can recreate this yourself along with some steps uh, that shady figured out this fourth mission though is a fight against primal dialga now what they also discovered is that if there is a boss fight um, and you set this up in a certain way, if you program a boss fight um, into one of these dungeons, this isn't something that should normally be able to happen. So this is uh, something crazy done with a Wonder Mail generator. And you'll see what I mean in a bit. You have a chance of hatching that boss from the egg that you get from the dungeon, which I think is absolutely insane. Now, please keep in mind, this may not work the first try. You only have a chance of hatching um, the boss Pokemon, in this case, Primal Dialga. Theoretically, if you have the know-how of the different um, boss events in the game and know how to work the Wonder Mail generator, you could use this um, with any number of Pokemon. And I think theoretically, I might go into this in a different video, you could get as many as you want. So I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna go through these two missions, see if we can get an egg, um, and if not, I'll keep on repeating um, until we uh, are able to figure it out. So let's get into it. So the missions are in Beach Cave, um, make sure to keep that in mind. There are some steps that I'm going to walk you through right now. All right, so this first mission, let me get all the riffraff out of the way here. Um, this is, again, not my save file, is to grab an Orenberry, and that is what's going to get you your egg. Now, make sure, this is very important, um, according to Shady, um, otherwise it might not work. Uh, actually, it probably won't work. Um is do not grab the Orin Berry on the first floor and do not bring one in your inventory. So you see I have zero items right now. Make sure you get the Orin Berry on the second floor. This is very important. If you don't get the Orin Berry on the second floor, the egg can only have Pokemon from the first floor um, in sort of the uh, Pokemon pool there. So make sure you get it on the second floor. It's very important. Otherwise this won't work. Uh, ignore everything else. There's an orange berry. Luckily, they have a 100% spawn rate. So we have our orange berry now and a little dainty box. Now we can proceed um, as normal. We're going to go to uh, <laughs> floor four, which will have a funny surprise for us. So yeah, just go about as normal. Make sure you, uh, you're able to get rid of this thing. 
Otherwise, you might have a little trouble. Um, another thing to keep in mind is you need to have completed the expedition uh, arc to get access to Chansey. Otherwise, obviously, you, you can't really hatch eggs, can you? <laughs> so yeah, that's that. That's all you need to do um, to get your egg. Also, make sure you don't have another egg in Chansey Daycare. That's very important. All right. So there's our egg. Now, again, this has a chance, a chance, uh, I'll repeat, a chance to be Primal Dialga. If it's not, um, you need to reset and try again until it is. I, I have still not gotten a successful attempt at this, um, but hopefully... Uh, We'll, we'll luck out on this first try here. So now we're not quite done yet. We do need to uh, actually hatch the egg itself. So let's go to Chansey and check to see if we have the egg. Positive we do, because we just got it from a, war a reward. So there we go. Now the fastest and easiest way to uh, progress the egg counter is actually just to go into the dojo here and fail a whole bunch of times. So that's what I'm going to do right now. Um, I don't know how many times exactly it is. Just keep on checking until you have it. Um, so I will be back with you guys as soon as the egg is ready to hatch, and we'll see if I got a primal Dialga or if I need to restart this whole thing. Let's see. All right, so our egg should be ready to hatch now. Hopefully it's primal Dialga. If not, well, I'll do this over again for you guys and uh, see if we get it. All right. All right, fingers crossed. A healthy shelter. All right, I will do this over again, and I will uh, see you guys in just a little bit. All right, here we go. All right, I went through and did the boring part again so you guys would not have to see it. Let's see uh, if it paid off for me this time. Let's see what I got. All right, let's head on over to Chansey. Check the egg. I think it's ready to hatch. A healthy Dialga, awesome. Wants to join our team, we're absolutely gonna say yes. And we're not gonna give him anything right now. But here, that is the glitch. It is crazy. I don't even know if it's called a glitch at this point, maybe more of an exploit. All right, so we got sent on over to the uh, uh, assembly. Let's go check him out. See the stats on him. Is gonna be level one. There we go, so summary. Join team. Don't see a portrait right there, so let's check out the uh, the Spinda Cafe. See if that works. And there you go. We have Primal Dialga on our team. Let's see what he looks like inside um, a dungeon real quick, and then that's it. You can uh, work on him, do what you want, improve his level. But yeah, let's see. And there you go, Primal Dialga. Just an absolutely insane glitch. It's so cool. I'm so glad uh, it was discovered. So again, huge thanks to Shady and Jinx Hijinx. This is insane. And again, theoretically, I don't see any reason why you couldn't just keep hatching them and hatching them. Um, but yeah, might be a, another silly video on that at some other point with a, another legendary Pokemon. But yeah, friends, thank you so much for watching. Um, again, I, I, <laughs> it's. It seems like I put up a video every other month at this point, um, but just a little update. I've been moving into a new house, um, helping my my family move into a new house, so just a lot going on. And work's almost done, so I'm almost on summer break. Make sure to join um, our community Discord server if you want to keep in touch, see how things are going with the community. We would love to have you. And yeah, well, friends, thank you so much for watching. I will see you all in the next video. Have a good one.